Are you worried that your baby isn't sleeping well? There are various causes that can disrupt their sleep. In this All for Babies video, we'll see why a baby doesn't sleep and what to do to help them sleep better. Baby sleep phases. The sleep phases of babies are not the same as those of adults. An adult sleep cycle has five phases. The first four are categorized as non-REM sleep or deep sleep, and the fifth phase is classified as REM sleep, known as rapid eye movement or light sleep. In contrast, babies only have two sleep phases, light sleep and deep sleep. Thus, the sleep pattern of babies is shorter, so it's normal for newborns to have light sleep and wake up more frequently as they move from one phase to another. When putting babies to sleep, both during the day and at night, they wake up more frequently as they move from one phase to another because they don't distinguish between daytime and nighttime hours. As they grow, sleep phases change and over time, they become more similar to those of adults. How much does a baby sleep? The hours of sleep for each baby are different and it's difficult to establish what amount of hours is considered normal for each child. However, factors such as age and behavior determine the sleep needs of each baby. Newborns up to two months are recommended to sleep between 16 and 20 hours daily. Then, babies from three to six months should sleep between 14 and 16 hours, with nine to 12 hours at night and two or three hours during the day. From one year old, it's normal for them to sleep 12 hours at night and one or two hours during the day, totaling around 13 hours daily. Finally, babies between two and three years old sleep between 10 and 11 hours at night and no more than one hour during the day, around 12 hours in total. Now let's see the five factors that can influence a baby's sleep and make them not sleep. One, age. Baby's sleep hours change according to age. Infant sleep evolves as the child grows. Therefore, to know how much a baby sleeps, you must consider what developmental stage they are in. Children under four months old wake up more often during the night. From four months onwards, they can sleep longer stretches, but it doesn't mean they sleep through the night. Two, hunger. If the baby is hungry or thirsty, they will be restless and won't fall asleep. We must make sure to feed them before bedtime. 3. Cold or heat. We must ensure to provide a comfortable sleeping environment. A very cold or hot environment can make the baby nervous and uncomfortable, making it difficult for them to fall asleep. 4. Tiredness. If the baby is tired, it may be harder for them to fall asleep. We must establish a sleep routine to avoid them being too tired when going to sleep. 5. Overstimulation. Stimulating activities and noises will keep them active and prevent them from sleeping. We must avoid these activities during sleep hours. Tricks to put a baby to sleep. On one hand, we recommend establishing routines and schedules for sleeping during the day and night. For example, bathing them before bedtime, having dinner, and then going to sleep. Encouraging these routines will help the baby relax and prepare for sleep both physically and emotionally. On the other hand, it's important to create a pleasant environment. Having a cozy space to sleep will promote the baby's well-being. It's advisable to have no light in a room or very dim light. The room should have a comfortable temperature and there should be silence to help them get used to sleeping without noise. Also, it's highly recommended to use sleep music. Singing lullabies to your baby or rocking them can be good habits to relax them and help them sleep. Avoid activities that overly stimulate them. In conclusion, each baby is unique so the pace of learning good sleep habits will never be the same as others. Be consistent, patient, and give them time. See you in the next All for Babies video.